This is the Pool Blaster Max LI. So this is the main unit, the actual vacuum unit. It has the on off button right here and it has a filter bag that sets down in there. And then it's got the nose cap, which connects on like this. And then this rotates up to lock into place, clicking securely there. And then you put the vacuum head with its nice little scrubby brushes right onto the end. And it also has a notch here that clicks into place and you're ready to go. Now this does not come with a pole, but you can use the pole from if you had a different pool cleaner or like this one is actually the, the telescoping pole off of our pool cleaning net um, so that we can keep our pool clean. And either of these work to connect onto here. You just have to push these white tabs in and slip it into place and then you're ready to go. So the on off button, like I said, is here and you want to turn this on before you set it in the water so that you don't get it to the bottom of your pool and go, oh, I can't turn it on. So this is the charging attachment and it just clicks right into place right in here. Make sure that it gets nice and solid in there. And then you use the charging cord, you plug it in, you plug it into the wall and it takes four hours to charge completely, either from first time you open it or after you've completely discharged it. Just don't leave it plugged in more than 24 hours and you're ready to clean your pool.